We have stepped into the kitchen for a big celebration. It's not just a big one, it's a major one. It's going down at the Pasta House, the 50th anniversary. It's being celebrated at the more than 10 family-friendly Italian restaurant locations across Missouri and Illinois. Joining us now with how they're gonna celebrate with specials and what you can enjoy and what makes this anniversary so special is Jen Durford. The Director of Marketing for Pasta House. Jen, thanks for being here this morning. Yeah, thanks for having me. We're excited. It's our uh, 50th anniversary, so we've been around since 1974. So I'm sure some of the people out there watching have um, been at the Pasta House Company either for an anniversary or a birthday or kids eat free on Sundays or even, um, you know, we have a um, reading, writing, ravioli program that many people have participated in in grade school. Mm -hmm. So we're just excited that it's our 50th anniversary. We wanted to celebrate with our families and um, all of our guests. And we want to get those regulars to keep coming back in and then bring some more people. We brought some of the favorites and most popular entrees and snacks here. What yes. do we got this morning? Yeah, so for our 50th anniversary, we have 50 cents toasted raviolis going on right now in the restaurant. Did you hear that, Angela, honey? 50 cent <laughs> toasted ravs going yeah. on in the restaurant. Yeah, and then we also have, since it's our 19, since we've been around since 1974, we mm -hmm. have our $19.74 pastas mm -hmm. that come with our famous Pasta House Company salad. So we took our five uh, top selling pastas, which is our classic spaghetti with meatballs, and um, our homemade lasagna. Mm -hmm. We have fettuccine alfredo. We also have rigatoni roma that's not actually out here right now. And our best seller is our pasta con broccoli. That's the one that um, outsells everything. But we took all of those and put those on a special price with our famous Pasta House Company salad just to celebrate for since we've been around since 1974. Why is it so important for this family and this company to continue to recognize the people who help keep their doors open? Many people have not only celebrated the pasta house, but they have worked at the pasta house mm -hmm. company and they've gone on to do some great things. So it's great when I get to meet people that, um, you know, say, oh, I used to be a busser. That was my first job mm -hmm. and things like that. So we're excited that we're in the community and we appreciate it. Um, try to get involved in as many um, community activities that we can and, and donations and things like that. So um, we just wanted to give back with this special. The spaghetti and meatballs, those are, those are homemade. We make our meatballs homemade every day, daily. Mm -hmm. Yes. And all of our pastas, um, we make each order to order. So um, make it fresh every day. Where are, are this, all the specials going on at each location? Yeah, each location these are. We're going to have some fun things going on throughout the year. This is our mascot. Um, and we're going to need a name for him. So that's coming up mm. uh, this year also. We want to do a, a contest or, or something like that. So I hope you can invite me back and we can talk about that. But we need to get a name for our mascot here. We but would love to. He's been hanging out with Fred Bird and the Blues and went to St. Louis University last week. So we're all over the place. He's been hanging around Elite Company. Yeah. Glad to have yeah. him here. We'll hopefully we can help you figure out a name. But what we can do is post this uh, whole interview online to show our viewers what kind of specials you guys are going to have to celebrate the 50th anniversary of Pasta House. The video speaks for itself. Get out there and help them celebrate. Jen, thank you for joining thank us this morning. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. And we'll see if we can't get you guys a, a name for this uh, waving tomato here. Sounds great. We can do better than waving tomato. Yes. We're back with more Fox News in the morning after the break.